Brisbane's 96.5, Pete, getting through a beautiful day in the River City, smack bang in the middle of summer, and it is warm and continues to be so, with some storms on the way too, as we head towards Christmas. Got a special guest on the line at the moment too, Matthew Bode is on the line. How are you, Matthew? I'm good, Peter. How are you? Yeah, I'm good, mate. Uh, first up, plans for Christmas. What have you got planned? Uh, a lot of training and uh, a lot of hard work, really, trying to get ready for next year's racing season. And that's what we're talking about this morning, too. Now, you've moved down to Brizzy. You're originally from Darwin. Correct. And you're, you raced a Formula V this year, hoping to step up to the V8 Supercar Dunlop Series next year. What are the? How's that looking for you, mate? Well, we're speaking to a few um, big partners at the moment, trying to secure the funding to go racing this, ne- next year. Um, but but from, from where the point, of view, point where I'm at at the moment, it looks relatively good, but you never know in the industry, unfortunately, but we'll be trying as hard as we can. What made you get involved in it in the first place? What, what quite a young age, or...? Oh, I only originally got started in racing in go-karting when I was about 18 years old. Prior to that, I'd been riding on motorbikes. And um, I remember Dad taking me out to a go kart track when I was younger, and I was just I was hooked hooked then. And pretty much from that point, I was just like, "This is what I want to do with my life." I have to work hard to get there, and still have to work hard. But it's definitely fun. It's worth it's worth um, the sacrifice I have to make. People, a lot of people don't realise too, Matthew. The absolute uh, well, you've got to be at peak fitness too, because you lose so much, so much fluid when you're racing, don't you? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, when we're getting the V8 supercar, um, those cars, generally, the cabin temperature alone um, is minimum 40 degrees in summer. It's uh, somewhere up in the 60 to 70 degree region. So you can, <laughs> you can imagine sitting in, a, in what's effectively a sauna and racing at the same time. It's, it's hard work and you lose, you lose a huge amount of fluid. Luckily, we've got the... Um, the hydration systems in the car to sort of keep the water going into us, but it's never never as cool as you'd like it to be. <laughs> now, tell us about the testing with Matt Stone Racing. Everyone knows Matt Stone Racing at Queensland and Raceway. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Um, so Matt Stone is uh, the son of Russell Stone uh, from Stone Brothers Racing, back when Stone Brothers Racing used to race in the yeah, supercars. And um, they're, they're pretty much one of the top teams in the development series. So it's, uh, it's a huge opportunity for me to be able to test with Matt Stone. It, it, it'd be a really good, really good time. As we know, when it comes to racing, you know, cars of any sort, it is not cheap. You need, uh, you need some, you know, big sponsorship backers to just to afford to, to be able to race, don't you? Yeah, correct. It's 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 amazing some of the money that's involved, but all, all that money, it's a, it is justifiable because it's just it's running the car like things like tires and brakes and just just the basic running of the car. Mate, we wish you all the best. I know it's an exciting time of your life, too, and it's going to be a big 2016. All the best for Christmas. Rest up and make sure you're ready to go for the for the new season. Mate, great to chat, and we'll uh, talk soon. Yeah, thanks a lot, that, Peter. Yeah, it'll, it'll be good, and you guys have a good Christmas, too. Yeah, he's got a big future ahead of him. Matthew Bogue, keep an ear out for that name. Coming up, details on the wonders of Christmas before 12 at Brisbane's 96.5.